Well, I was uh, just outside. He said temperatures uh, below zero centigrade, which means winter is just around the corner. Now, if you own a Cherokee 140 like I do, you're uh, probably considering preheating your engine at some point in time. The unfortunate part about it is uh, my particular airplane is sitting outside and it's nowhere near an electrical plug. So the question came up, how am I going to preheat this airplane when I want to go flying during the winter? Well, I came up with something. Stay tuned. I'm going to show you what I bought. The problem with winter and an airplane that you've got parked outside is preheating. So this is what I've done. I've looked all over the place. I don't have an electrical outlet near where I've got it uh, parked, so I can't heat it uh, by means of uh, what I used to have was a little electric uh, heater that I had in, uh, in uh, just in the cowling. So what I went out and bought this Mr. Heater. It's called the Little Buddy. It says it heats up to 100 square feet, 20% more heat than the largest catalytic heater and so forth. And the nice thing about it, it just uses these little propane uh, cylinders. This is what it looks like when it's assembled. Uh, you've got the base, the little propane uh, container, and then you've got the little buddy itself. Now, I'll just show you how this all works. First of all, you don't need this. So anyway, you'll see how this works. I'm going to take this off here. Okay, there's the propane bottle right there. This is the full one. Okay, it smells a little bit because uh, there's the valve in there. And then when you put it in there and screw it back on, there'll be a little bit of an odor. So there it is, screwed on. It's real easy to start. It has the uh, button on the side out here. You've got the on button and the off button. And another thing that you have to remember too is if this thing keels over, it'll shut off. Okay, so what happens is you turn it on with the on button here. Okay, now you watch. I'm going to click that button. And what happens is inside, you'll see that little, I'll just hold it there. You'll see the little flame there. Okay, now you hold that on button. That's this one on the side, down for 30 seconds. Now she'll start waffling. Okay, well, there you go, you can see. And what's gonna happen is, that little white area will just light up and turn red hot. What I do with this is I stick this into the right hand side of the uh, aircraft engine, and uh, right by the firewall. And I'm going to show you how that's done. Uh, we're going to go to the airplane and I'll show you how I put it in there. Now you'll notice there it's nice and red hot. And now watch this. Now you see the flame there. If you tip this thing any more than I think it's 30 degrees, it'll shut. There you go. You'll notice how it shuts off. So you have to be very careful that if, uh, if you're putting it in, what I normally do is I, uh, I start it first and uh, then I, uh, I put it in and I'm very careful that I don't tip it any more than 30 degrees. If you tip it any more, yeah, she'll shut off. But once it's in there, just make sure it's still on and then cover it up and put your engine cowling down. And also uh, then you can put your engine cover back on it and uh, keep all the heat in there. And uh, on a cold day, it'll depend. Sometimes you have to leave it in there for an hour. Sometimes you have to leave it in there for two hours. But uh, at least you've got uh, sort of like portable heat. So that's the way I do mine. And, um, uh, and it's not that expensive, these little things here. I, and uh, what's nice about it, it's portable. There you go. It's a 3800 BTU propane heater. Portable heat for warmth, comfort in the great outdoors. And it says designed and approved for outdoor use only. Okay. So so that's what I use for uh, my, it's a uh, Mr. Heater. It's uh, called the Little Buddy. And it's the smallest one that they make, or the smallest one they make. And uh, that's it. Uh, oh yeah, and I was just gonna show you as well, on the side here, it also has an off button. So if you have it um, 
on and she like I it shut off because I tipped it over uh, but if you want to shut it off uh, when it's still upright just click that button and the flame uh, which is now off but it's in here will will uh, will go off anyway that's uh, that's it uh, for the little mystery heater and uh, like I say that's what I use uh, and I find that uh, uh, reasonable portable portable enough uh, for me to take with me put in my car and uh, well worked for me hope it works for you anyway we'll see you at the airplane and uh, I'll show you how I install it okay uh, we're uh, we're at the airplane now and I've got the uh, little uh, buddy here with me and uh, I'll just show you where I put it in the airplane uh, I stick it right in here like this so basically this is what you're looking at now you can close it but unfortunately it still sticks out a bit but you can close this part here okay but this is all it is and uh, you just ignite it and uh, it basically keeps the engine warm uh, for the uh, period of time you want to set it in here it just depends how long uh, and how cold it is that uh, the length of time that you leave it in there okay so there you go the uh, engine cover is back on again this uh, the cowling underneath will be pushed in by the uh, engine cover so uh, yeah the latch won't lock but at least it's uh, toasty warm in there now and uh, that's the way I uh, basically uh, heat my uh, aircraft in the winter now <laughs>